Alright, welcome back to Out of the Edge, I guess. Uh, last time I did both of the uh, neutral runs. And now we're going to the semi-hero route. And si since I'm going to be having guests every for every subsequent playthrough, I'm actually not going to be sh uh, skipping the cutscenes just so everyone has about an equal amount of time to shine, I guess. So, yeah, I got someone with me, so if you want to introduce yourself, go ahead. I I'm a crystal. So what are your experiences w w uh, with this game? <laughs> uh, basically, I've been playing this game since I was a little kid. And why can't I remember? Like, if it was actually one of my favorite Sonics growing up. Hmm. I'm confirmed shit taste. Hey. <laughs> And yet, I no, I was gonna say I rem I remember playing this game at a friend's house one time, and I thought it was like the coolest thing ever. So yeah. Look how pathetic they are. But that's the thing about being a teenage boy. You think everything that's edgy is good. Yeah. Stupid as a hedgehog with a gun. Yeah. Hey. Oh hi, Goku. Who are you, and how do you know I'm Shadow? And what are you talking about? But yeah, you know, I just love how Black Doom doesn't clarify anything. Just yeah. That all about? It's like, oh, just uh, get the Chaos Emeralds. Like, why? Like, I don't know. Right just do it, bro. Shut up, Shadow. <laughs> is to get those Chaos Emeralds. Uh. It's like, and then Shadow's just like, oh yeah, but I trusted. Like, obviously, okay, really evil you. guy. It's like, <laughs> let's trust the obviously, like, super evil dude. He's, like, killing everyone. It's like, sure. Ever play Kingdom Hearts? Yeah. Okay, I believe you. Okay, I believe you. Yeah. <laughs> uh... I don't mind All the right. idea of, uh, try- of, uh, trying to, um... Do more of Shadow's past and like trying to, I guess, fill in the holes. I guess, not that the game really yeah. does it that well. Yeah, like this clearly is supposed to be a sequel to Adventure Two. Yeah. Whereas Heroes was just another Sonic game. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> One thing about I like about this era of Sonic is that the games follow these. SA1, 2, and Heroes and Shadow all follow a specific continuity together, um, where like yeah. each one kind of goes into the next in a way, whereas pretty much each game after this is just a self-contained story, for better or worse, depending on the game, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, like, that is a problem I have with modern Sonic games that the Adventure Era had. Like, yeah. <laughs> It feels like things actually happen. Yeah. Whereas with that. in the modern games, it feels more like nothing matters. Yeah. Hey. I feel like Unleashed, for example, I think is a good way of uh, doing a self-contained story and actually feeling like there's stuff to care about. I guess. No, I've never actually played Unleashed. Hmm. Like, it's still factory sealed on my shelf. Oh, what version do you have? Uh, PS3. Okay, that's the one I- I have the PS3 and the Wii versions. Yeah. Like, PS3- no, uh, Unleashed is completely different. Yeah. I do think it's- uh, I do- Feel, feel like it's warranted to try and play both versions at some point because yeah they are like completely different yeah so to actually talk about the game yeah the light speed dash is your it's basically how you get to top speed yeah I am I'm not sure if anyone actually cares but behind that locked door we just passed is some worthless vehicle 
Yeah, I haven't actually talked about this yet, but each level has five hidden keys that you can collect, and uh, they will unlock you a special door that will give you, like, a special vehicle or a, a I gun I think that is stuff. not worth it. Yeah, I've never... I've only ever, like, got all the keys in select few levels. I've never been finding them all. Because they're, like, crazy hidden <laughs> sometimes. Yeah. This is the only level where I've gotten all five keys. Yeah. Once I find all of the enemies. Because for rewards are truth. not worth it. Yeah. Yeah. It's like you don't get like oh. uh, special stages or anything like in Heroes by getting the keys. So instead, oh hey, here's a vehicle that lowers your top speed. <laughs> yeah. It's totally worth it. Use a vehicle that's slower than you and also controls like crap. Yeah. I just love how they tried making the motorcycle look amazing, but you almost never get it. Black alien yeah. Also, why is Africa curved on that map? And every city <laughs> is reporting significant damage and casualties. Among them, Westopolis is receiving Anyways, uh, due to what was I saying? Uh, <laughs> Oh yeah, Downtown the motorcycle, you never get it. Destroyed. And Unconfirmed sources have also there's fucking Africa again. In West yeah. Shadow? Does it have a dick? Deploy the <laughs> now. And if you find Shadow with the black aliens, then kill them all. But sir, isn't Shadow on our side? I gave you an order, what's soldier. going on with Asia on those maps? Just... I have no idea. You can't fool me, Shadow. I noticed that for the first time a few weeks ago, and I have not been able to stop thinking about it. Hmm. Oi. Also, you just gotta love how there's just kinda two emeralds in one city. No one tells me what to do. Yeah. I have my own reasons for collecting the chaos. Sure is convenient. You really don't yeah. understand the situation here, do you? Like, Perhaps you remember when people actually cared about the Chaos Emeralds? Yeah, I, I love the contrast from, like, SA1 where it's just like, Wow, Tails, you got a Chaos Emerald, that's crazy! And then Sonic in this game is just like, Look, Shadow, she looked fi like five meters in front of you. There's an Emerald, go pick it up. <laughs> oh, no, I'm more talking about... Back in the adventure era, where the, where the chaos downloads are the main plot point. Oh yeah, that's true. Fast track Sonic Forces. What? Chaos Emeralds? Tails, are you smoking again? I've never heard of any Chaos Emeralds. Yeah, no, The only no. thing that'd be stupider would be if I turned yellow and became invincible. <laughs> yeah, they weren't invincible. He's a new guy. Oh. Tails, right? Yeah. I'm surprised. I was expecting the emeralds to play a part of Force's I? story, but yeah. yeah. Kind of missed the emeralds playing an integral oh, role because I guess I underestimated they his don't really do that anymore. Like, there's definitely something going on out there. And instead, yeah. now it's up to for me Red to Ring's power supersonic now. Yeah. <laughs> Except forces where he's powered by DLC. Yeah. And that was tempor temporarily you had to buy it, which is stupid. Wowzers. Hey, like that. You saw him too, didn't uh, you? Those black creatures floating around here. Where the sound effect doesn't actually stop while Knuckles is introducing himself. Yeah. Stop attacking the good guys. So I'm supposed to be I'm doing the oh, uh, dark crowd for this. Stage, aren't I? This is to go to uh, yeah. Crypto Castle, yeah. Yeah. Look out behind you. But yeah, uh. How do you feel about the morality system in this game? The whole like dark hero neutral stuff going on. Oh, well, basically, I do kind of like the idea. It was just executed terribly. Yeah. Because Sonic. Yeah. Yeah. That in Shadow doesn't control the best in this game. Yeah, it's like someone thought that H Heroes was like not slippery enough, so they just kind of made Shadow like. All right, all right, man. 
Shadows on jet skates. So remember yeah. how we hit everybody on butter shoes and heroes? Uh, yes, sir. We need more butter. Yeah. Uh, uh, sir, how much do we use? All of it. Uh, all of it! Yeah. Pretty much. It's like, it's like, it feels like you're on ice the entire game. Yeah, like, shadows on jet skates. Yeah. Not ice. There's the difference. Yeah. And also, because we're doing the dark mission, <laughs> getting the hero, getting more hero points will actually hurt your ranking. Yeah, I actually, I didn't actually know about that for the longest time. It, it's like, keep it, if you make sure to do the way that. Rank yeah, yeah, like, the way ranking works is that for a dark mission, it adds your dark score to your neutral score, subtracts the hero score, and adds the time bonus. Yeah. It does so, the opposite in uh, hero missions. And on neutral missions, it's all neutral score and time bonus. Yeah, so depending on so, what type of mission you're doing, you should pay attention to what you're killing. Eh, honestly, it's more negligible, because the time bonus is absurd. Yeah, getting A ranks in this game is pretty <laughs> easy. <laughs> yeah, so if Harry does any, does not do um, an all A rank run, he is pathetic. <laughs> well, I think I got a B in one of my neutral playthroughs, so... When? I don't remember what stage it was, but... Whatever it was, I would've gotten an all-A rank run with no deaths. <laughs> and Chaos Blast means infinite ammo and invincibility. Yeah. I infinite it ammo is the main... Huh? Yeah. It also has a side effect of letting you use a shockwave attack. Yeah. Infinite ammo is like the main benefit to them, really. Yeah. Like... Ah, uh, chaos control actually confuses me. Like... Okay. Your goal is to kill X number of things in the level. Here's your reward for doing that. Skip the level. Yeah. It, I don't, it doesn't really benefit you unless you're doing the, the um, uh, neutral cool. pathway specifically. Yeah. Also, can we just talk about how stupid it is that Black Doom will seal the way the only spring to get to yeah. the... Uh, yeah. Is there a way to, like, cheese this? I don't know. Hmm. Fine. You do gotta kill the worms. Yeah, it's like, I hate the design sometimes, where it's like, you're doing the dark mission, and the only way to get to the object is to kill dark side enemies. It's like, why? Now, let's see what no, right? happens when this temple is awakened. Like, Shadow, you traitor! Open the, Open the door, you idiot! Yeah, basically. Perfect. I... If you would open the door for me, I wouldn't kill your men. I do think they but should But since have... the door is blocked by their life, I have to end it. Yeah. I do think they, they should have had a system where if you had more dark points than hero points, then the alien should leave you alone and vice versa yeah. for the gun soldiers. Because otherwise, yeah. the, everyone just kind of kills you without any mercy. No, right? It's like, gonna have also, more... just imagine this scene above Donald Trump. Oh God! <laughs> Tell the commander generals that the United Federation will never surrender to terrorists. It'd just be amazing. Yeah. Better yet, this Donald Trump with that picture. Yeah. Two heroes. No like seriously, if I had access to your printer, I. Would... I would keep that picture on my desk at all times. Yeah. We must stand united to defend our world against these invaders. I mean, who wouldn't want a picture of Sonic and Shadow posing in front of the White House? It's true. And I'm not even American. Yeah. 
I would kind of like a uh, continuity thing go, uh, happen Isn't again with Sonic because Eggman? I kind of miss the games connecting together like this. He can tell me about yeah. those black creatures. <laughs> In a way, like even the classics did that with like. Um, oh wait, no, Harry. We do have that. Sonic Mania leads into forces, and then forces goes to die in a fire and leads back into Mania. True. <laughs> I guess. The doctor must have Anyways, this is a new stage we haven't played yet. Um, uh, well, this is a fun one. Let me just see. Yeah, so it the... like... yeah, so you want to do a to... hero mission here? Okay. Yeah. Well, this is the only time in the game where you'll actually use the, uh, like, close quarters oh! combat. Okay. <laughs> what even happened there? The doctor must have yes. gone this way. Good. <laughs> that was good. I love the controls in this game, they're great. I've never seen that happen before. Yeah, it's it's annoying because I, I I um I love heroes and even I can admit that game has really finicky controls. Um, yeah. But I that said, th since this game controls relatively similar to, to heroes, I can enjoy enjoy it on a base level. But sometimes it's just too much even for me. Yeah, like this game does have control issues. Yeah. <coughs> oh, hey, it's Eggman. Yeah, and this little machine thing. Um, there's something else I didn't actually mention before. Um, it's each... kind of like this one. Yeah. Um, each, um... Well, not everyone. The characters that don't fly, I believe, you can actually control with a second player. Uh, which is pretty cool, yeah. I guess. So, basically, everybody except Eggman and Black Doom. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure she can control Charmy, but... <laughs> oh no, I'll have to try that later. Yeah. yeah this is definitely no... I definitely wouldn't uh, put this on the same level as, like, Han Castle. <laughs> but... I, I like the whole haunted house kind of aesthetic going on. They don't really do this I that much in Sonic. Harry skipped a gun. Did I? That's all. There we go. Oh, laughed if you miss. And now touch the child. Save until Dream. you touch her. <laughs> <laughs> Dead. <laughs> There's only room for one girl around, and I'm already here. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel about the gunplay in this game? <laughs> it works. Yeah. It has no business being in a Sonic game, but it works. Yeah, I do think... The gunplay works well enough for it is. It's probably it's probably some of the funner parts of the game. Yeah. I have no idea how you're supposed to control which arrow you go to. I just kind of let, let yeah, it me neither. follow. Like yeah. Also, fun fact about the grinding animation: if there's a um <laughs> spring at the end of the uh, rail. If you're in the middle of your dash animation, you will jump over it and fall. Yeah. I learned, I learned that the hard way. Yeah. And you just gotta love how you can, like, build up speed infinitely in the, in the rails in this game. Yeah. Although well, I can never figure out if you're supposed to mash the button or hold it. Hmm. I always just mash it. Yeah, me too. And take the high route. Are we going high or no. low? I guess low. I do feel... I feel like the game would would be better off with like every stage in, instead of just having really... I uh, dropped the gun. Yeah. 
Or do that. Whatever works, I guess. Yeah. But yeah, uh, I feel like the game would have been better off if like every stage had like a different route for each for each uh, was it each mission? Because there's yeah. some stage some stages have it so oh you need to do the dark route go go this way and you do need to do yeah. the hero route you go the other way and it's like almost an entirely different stage like you go you oh. do completely different level design and whatnot. I like that was way better. Yeah. Honestly. <laughs> yeah. It's like some stages already do it, so like if they just did that for the whole game, I think this could have been legitimately really good. Instead, it's just mediocre. Yeah, I don't, I don't hate this game, and like after thinking about Shadow it a lot, huh? I have no idea which one of these I think Shadow able to go after Black Goo. Yeah, I don't know. So we just kind of follow this wall for a little bit. Yeah. And if you keep holding up, Shadow just jitters. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Amy. You're oh, okay, man. Wow. So how did Cheese get in here? I'm sorry. Burn. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Okay. Seriously, how did he get in the wall? Yeah, like, it should be crushed or something. Hey. Uh, if you want to stay clear of trouble, then stay away I mean, from that. Jazz hands! <laughs> yeah, jazz hands. Hey. Uh. <laughs> Perfect. <clears throat> and now it's time for the first boss. Two. Yeah. Another chaos emerald. Are there are there always uh, two bosses in a story route, or is it does it vary depending on uh, what you do? Oh, uh, like bosses are tied to the stage. Right, right. But it is possible to fight this thing twice. Oh, oh yeah, that's true, that's true. Now, like, do you have a hero or neutral mission here? And then the opposite mission in the next level. Yeah. If a neutral mission here leads to the doom, so do you have a hero mission here and then the neutral mission? Yeah. Because, fuck the doom. Oh, uh, yeah, that's... That might... All right. It's like that and uh, the other, the other indoor arc level. level are probably my least favorite stages in the game. Yeah, like the, the arc is the worst level in the game. Yeah, I especially hate the dark mission where you have to kill all the enemies because I, I swear like, I swear some of those gun soldiers are just hidden off stage somewhere. Like I always have yeah. issues trying to find everyone. Yeah, this boss isn't really uh, anything special. Oh, no. but you know, one time I uh, light dashed those rings near where you start, and I wound up jumping off the stage. Oh. I never knew you could hurt him by jumping. Yeah, it doesn't do that much. It does like a sliver of health, but. Sorry, doctor, but that jazz hands is mine. Jazz hands. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I always thought Perfect. he had no hurt box up there. Hmm. You matter it hurt you before it hurts him. Yeah, you'd think that, but... Yeah. And now, like, man gets involved in the story. I do he like how he just beat him up. Yeah, he's just kind of, kind of suddenly here now. Um, but I, I do kind of like how there's a free wa freeway war going on, pretty much. Yeah, like... <laughs> I do like Eggman's motivation, like... How am I gonna take over the city if there's no city to take over? <laughs> yeah. Oh, kinda like how he was, um... <clears throat> what would he have done if, no uh... This baby could nobody be. listened to him in Adventure 2? Blow up yeah. the earth so he could take it over? 
to this planet. I guess I don't oh, yeah, know. Oh yeah, hey Christian. This thing was brought to Earth 2,000 years ago. <laughs> so why is this not in the Bible? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> checkmate, cr checkmate, Christians. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> so I, I want I want to hear about Black Doom's like um at, like fortress thing or whatever in the Bible. It'll be great. <laughs> yeah. Don't forget that part of the Bible where a little girl kills God. <laughs> oh goodness. Uh. <laughs> uh. Alright, so hero mission here, I believe. Uh, yes. Which is basically find the old things. We brought... Yeah. We brought this thing up to the sky. Now we're gonna tear it down. Yeah, this stage's placement always confused me because this is pretty much, as far as I'm, I'm as far as I'm aware, just Glyphic Canyon lifted up into the sky because it's been activated. But it's also in the neutral pathway, so um. You don't have to activate this thing to get it activated. Yeah, it's weird. So I feel I feel like they should have moved this stage somewhere else, so you had to do the dark mission to go to it, otherwise it's, it doesn't yeah, like, really add up. Yeah, like, um, maybe make, uh, Glyphic Canyon stage free on the all dark route? Yeah. And this is stage 4 on the all dark route. Yeah, because I do know there's, there is a stage that you need to, you need to do the dark route on to get to a specific stage. I don't know which one it is, but I think it might be the only one in the game, and they should have just done that with this one instead, I think. Uh, like, the only two levels where you have to do a dark mission to get to them are going through the president's porn folder for Chaos Emerald. <laughs> yeah. And, blowing, and then blowing up Westopolis Act 2. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, but it's also that arc flying level if you hate the Doom like I do. Yeah, that stage is. That stage is alright, like, you're just kind of flying around for the whole thing, just shooting everything up. You know, I've never actually played it. Mm. I've because actually, um, done... Fuck the Doom. Yeah, I've actually managed to get all the A ranks in this game before, and it unlocks Expert Mode the same way you get Super Hard Mode and Heroes for getting all the A ranks. Um... Uh. Can we not? Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Uh, I'm a fan. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I love this game. Yeah. <laughs> For what it's worth, um, I will, I, I will, I, I play, I'll play this game over Shad Crystal when 06. So, yeah. It's not much of a. Okay, cut out there, so I thought you said you'd play this game over me. No! <laughs> no, uh, no, I was saying I, I, I will put. I, I play this game over 06 and Shad Crystal. And maybe Secret Rings. Yeah. Where's it Chad Crystal? Huh? Never knew I had alternate forms. <laughs> I mean, we've got Shattered Crystal. Can we not do this again? Okay. I like how you can Going fine, have, shut up. I, I love how you can have Eggman be on your side, and you just- I wonder how my robots are doing, and you just kill them. You're doing fine. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. Shadow. Moments before killing all of Eggman's robots. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh, I think that's the only time they use a crusher like this. Hmm. 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 I say since we're. We're in this stage. I don't know if you're familiar with um, 
the uh, Sky Troops level mod in Generations. The uh, yeah, I've heard of it. Yeah, it's a really cool reimagining of this stage. And like, yeah, I know like, like when at the end, like I think bits at the end have it so you end up grinding on the egg flea itself. Nice. <laughs> yeah, it's really cool. Actually. I really need to read my generations on PC. Mm. It's pretty much worth it just for the mods, really. Yeah. The only game I've done that for is like Puyo Tetris, though. Yeah. Yeah. And even that was a Christmas gift. I I like the mod someone did where it's just replacing Oz mod with the plushie. <laughs> Uh, wait, replacing who? They replaced Owl's model uh, with the plushie instead, and it looks really <laughs> funny. Nice. What did Arl plushie that that beats up Puyo and calls you gay? Yeah, <laughs> I love those images. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Or, um,. Haunted Bruno Charity plushie licks your face and calls you a liar. Yeah. Now turn back. There we go. Hi. Two more. Alright, now you want to not use your chaos control. Yeah, there is um, a funny trick you can do. I don't think I'm ever going to do it in this playthrough, but um, if you go on a checkpoint, and press and use chaos control at the same time. The game will kind of get confused, and you'll have you'll just kind of have infinite chaos control, which is pretty freaking wow. hilarious. I've never done it before, so I don't oh. know how precise it is. But you can just do that to cheese neutral missions. Nice. I f I do feel like this is probably one of the better stages in the game. Like, I like the atmosphere and the music's pretty good. Definitely a highlight. Yeah. Right. So for what it's worth, I don't with some glaring exceptions like the the indoor arc levels, I don't think the level design is bad in this game. Like, there are some uh, levels that are better than others, <laughs> but Yeah, and like Nothing will ever be as bad as the Doom. Yeah, it's like everything looks the goddamn same in that place. Uh, there we go. Also, can we just comment on the horrible choice of words about black creatures? I cannot betray yeah. the or doctor. black aliens. Those black creatures really mean business. Uh, Hey Shadow, those black aliens are really bad. Perfect. You gotta yeah. help me get rid of them. Yeah. I. Nice. Because we. Don't worry, Shadow. Together we can make America great again. <laughs> Take together we can show the world what we can do. <laughs> You're all deported. <laughs> Hi. Also, I have a great line coming up. Oh yeah. <laughs> What's up, Shadow? Not you again. Nice to see you too. Looks like those black creatures are headed out to space. We're on Ooh. our way to the Ark, so I guess that means we're going too. Great, <laughs> great <laughs> line. <laughs> That's like Im <laughs> impeccable <laughs> logic. <laughs> the hell. I gotta love it when translation. <laughs> I gotta love it when the translation is just completely stupid. Yeah. <clears throat> oh my god, I'm trying to think of something really stupid. Mm. <coughs> uh. Yeah, I can't really Space think of any. Colony. Arc. This place it's not off the top of my head. So familiar, but why? I just this remembered. Where I? You ever played Puyo Fever? Um, I Maria? played uh, Amity's story up to the final boss. Anyway. <laughs> what do you think about Arl's on. Diamond Cutie? 
Oh yeah, I've heard of that. Um, Looks like the party's uh, Time to rock this is and interesting, roll. I guess. Uh, you up for this shadow? Oh, Sega. Yeah. And never forget Battle Network. Yeah. Which has incredible lines such as, "What a polite young man she was." <laughs> Oh god! It's like let, let, let's uh let's uh call her a tomboy in like the worst way possible, I guess. Oh, more like. Hey, should we bother translating this? Nah. Nah. nah screw it. Uh, oh, Battle Network Four. Why are you such a mistake? Yeah. So I'm actually going to take my time with this one, because this is a really stupid requirement for the neutral mission. Because the, um, the uh, hero mission Racing goes to the tonic. same... Hmm? Yeah, but like, you have a five minute time limit to beat Sonic Super Goal. Yeah. And that time limit is no... It's real easy. Yeah. <laughs> but it also means, with the neutral mission, you gotta stall. Yeah, because like, uh, instead of just picking the neutral mission on the menu and just having that um, automatically make it so you finish the neutral mission instead, no, like as long as you just get to the goal in the timer in general, you'll just go, you'll just activate like the hero mission requirement. Yeah, and it's really dumb. You just kind of just have to sit at the goal ring until timer gun, uh, timer, timer runs out. Yeah. Also, am I the only person who finds it weird that Dark Missions send you up while Hero Missions send you down on the map? Instead of the other way around? That is a little bit weird, yeah. I never really thought about it too much, but... I do like, I do like how this stage brings back the whole gravity gimmick that... Was it Crazy Gadget did in uh, SO2? I... <laughs> I think so. Yeah. Saucer seems to hover above the ground, but it doesn't stir. Something tells me that I don't want to touch that green energy fluid. Oh no, what gave it away, Shadow? See, but it's actually liquid aids. Is this the Ark's power plant? <laughs> I mean... Uh, like the, yeah. the Ark is powered by AIDS and coronavirus. Oh god, we're bringing this up. <laughs> Well, I'm getting demonetized. <laughs> it's fine, you I don't- You were monetized to begin with? Not really. <laughs> I used to be monetized, <laughs> but like, YouTube just said no one day. I got- It, it was stupid anyway, uh, because like, I, I- I was lucky to get like, five cents like, every couple weeks. So it's like, uh, bruh. In all my YouTube tries, I never hop hit money. Mm. Still, oh, I just stopped trying. St uh, still trying to find a job at this point, like. Yeah. Reesh. In here. Yeah, I do. I do like the. Uh, how this like kind of harkens back to the well, like final rush, final chase. Yeah, like, <clears throat> this really does help it feel like a sequel and just push yeah. forward. You can skip a rail. Yeah. Let's just grind slowly because I know the end's like right there. <laughs> or not? Just have boost yeah. rings. Okay. Fine. So now yeah. we just have to sit here for like a minute. Good. This is good design, I like Zach this. Zach Life. <laughs> uh, so not great. <laughs> Never really been in a serious relationship. I mean... Yeah. And people on dating sites keep thinking I'm a boy. No. Yeah. The most I've been in a relationship is like for like a week. Like we we watched like inc the Incredibles or something, but then it was just like, yeah, this ain't. Ah, really... I tell you now, she was wife material. 
Yeah, it's like, yeah, this ain't going anywhere, so let's just stop this. Yeah, I've never had a relationship. Mm. No I would. It'd be nice to be in a serious one one day, but. Yeah. But at this point, like right now, I'm more concerned with just getting my life sorted out. Yeah, same here. Also, I love how. Was that a bad idea? Huh? Was that a bad idea to drink nail polish remover? Uh, shadow, old buddy. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> well, the well, the bottle literally says, "Do not drink, here. you yeah. stupid moron." <laughs> <clears throat> so I like how this neutral mission doesn't make any sense because, uh, sorry, some... Shadow. One score, one chaos emerald for me. And then you just Finally, get get an emerald anyway. The chaos emerald. <laughs> yeah, and then you just get the emerald anyway. Like, what happened? Uh, well, Shadow learned how to pickpocket. Either that, or someone just <laughs> someone just left a fake emerald there for Sonic just to troll him. Was it real? Whoa! No, it fails. Yeah. Whoa! Where did you get that fake emerald? Who are you? Wait, how do you fake emerald? But this is a real thing. <laughs> yeah. Right? Also, I just love this guy. Like, how do you know me? I know you, Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> Pretty much. Me and Maria. Hi. Oh yeah, so yesterday was National Maria Day. Mm. Maria was like a day when we me. all recollect when she some random girl of space I aids knew. got shot. And because of Pretty you, much. she was killed. <laughs> How do you feel about? I, I guess it's gonna the plan to create that uh, bring this up because creature. the game doesn't tell you this until like eight something minutes in the final boss. But this is this Fine. this is the the actual shadow from SA2. Uh, how do you feel about this? How how do you feel about them bringing Sh Shadow back to, from the dead? Uh, well, you see, I never finished Adventure Two so, growing up, and my disc scratched, <laughs> so I you never knew he died. Me. Oh. It's not just about Maria. Thanks to you, everyone I knew and loved was killed when the Ark was destroyed. Girl. Worst of all, my family. <clears throat> Finally, justice is served. I don't hate the fact that they brought Shadow back, but I do feel, feel like it diminishes some of SA2's ending. Because like, yeah, just take Shadow was designed. Yeah. Tell me that you really like Shadow was designed to be killed at the end of that one game. Yeah. So bringing him back does feel kind of cheap. Truth. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I. I can appreciate them trying with this game. How it's like let let's try and um bring like do more with Shadow's past and fill in the gaps that might have been there and all that stuff. Like I think that's fine if you're gonna bring Shadow back. Um, yeah. But, yeah, I don't know. Oh. <clears throat> that means, huh? Ball! This Cosmic Ball! Collapsing. Yeah. Probably the actual hardest level in the game. Yeah, uh, especially like in expert mode, because like, in expert oh. mode, the game doesn't feel that different for most of the stages, but for some reason, uh, the developers just thought that this level wasn't hard enough, so they just made it like, like insane in expert mode, so you, you're probably gonna end up losing like pretty much all your lives here. Different in expert mode? Huh? Oh, uh, what's different in expert mode? Expert mode, they change up like level design and whatnot, and I believe okay. at the start of each stage, you get like some character talking to you. It's like, oh, good luck, Shadow, and all this stuff. Um. And uh, since there's no like mission objectives or whatever, all stages I just get to the goal ring. So I wonder how they handle uh, that mission where you can't where you nuke Westopolis. Oh yeah, where there I... is no goal ring. 
I'm not sure how they did that one, because I know... I believe what they did is, like... Um... Actually, I, well, I don't remember what the order of the stages were, but it pretty much st obviously starts at Westopolis and then just kind of uh, loops around the stage list, and then I think it ends with just doing all the final stages. Okay, I'm not well. entirely sure how it works, but <laughs> something like that. Uh. Are those guys can block bullets? Yeah, they're kind of annoying that way. Bluff! Left. Oh! Oops. Hold left. No. Oh, you missed the key. Yeah, that's fine. Oh well. Not like it's worth anything. <laughs> We're not actually doing the Harry mission, but I'm just gonna do this because memes. Find the computer room! Find the computer room! Find the computer room! Find the computer room! Okay, there's enough of that. <laughs> no, I just realized we have Find the Computer Room as another channel. Why is there no Find the Chaos Emerald? Yeah, I mean, Find the Chaos Emerald. I think it's just the way that, um, uh, I think it's the way that Vector says it. Eh. <laughs> Also, we just passed by a random artificial chaos. Yeah, pay no, pay no attention to that. Uh, yeah, cause... this just based on a Malaysian water god. Nothing to see here. Yeah, I do kind of like it in a story, in terms of like story context though, because uh, Professor Gerald, um, in canon, did visit Angel Island at one point. So, I do, yeah. I would assume that he would have learned something about chaos. So. It would make sense that he tried to create those artificial ones at some point. Oh, that was ballsy. A little bit, yeah. Oh, the music the music is great, by the way. Uh, this I feel like this yeah. soundtrack is severely slept on because some of the tracks in this game I think are really <clears throat> good. Yeah. But nobody cares. Yeah. <clears throat> like, I was legitimately surprised to hear West Opalus remixed in Forces. Yeah. But it was for a story about Shadow, so it does make some sense. Yeah. Okay, so there's actually a second layer of platforms under this. Yeah. It's like the only part that still consistently kills me. Yeah, this. I remember, I think this part in the expert run was like, they, they like, changed the position of the platforms to make it like, kind of absurd. And I think sometimes yeah, you actually like... had to use a spin dash to get enough speed. Um. Wow. Oh god. Uh. Good. Yeah, like, this is the hardest platform in the entire game, I'd say. Yeah, yeah, I'd agree with that. Because this game overall is... I'd say pretty easy, all things considered, but like, yeah, this stage in particular is, um, a bit more on the challenging side. Yeah, like, <clears throat> I actually never beat this level as a kid. Hmm. Oh, come on. Can I just, yeah, come on. I would have saved my jump dash to try and save myself after getting there. I suppose. I'm gonna just see so if I can, okay. like, uh, if I can look down, that will be great. <laughs> ah. Yeah, I'm just gonna go down here. Okay, you're golden. And this is what I did beat the level. Yeah. Don't, uh, don't... Don't do the accelerate button on these because the yeah. level of hop will actually make... Off. Yeah, the hop will actually make Shadow go way. go o yeah, the hop will make Shadow go over the spring. So don't do that. Yeah. Alright. Oh, okay, I still got some ways to go. Ah, but you're almost there. I 
Nope. <laughs> then falls for my test. <laughs> yeah. Good stuff. It's just like Metal Harbor. Where am I? Oh now? yeah. I love how it oh Yeah, I love how it looks like Shoot. Sonic's just about to fall off and die. Oh no, I'm gonna fall off stage! But at least I hit the goal ring. Back on Perfect. solid ground. I like how I have like li no dark uh, dark uh, dark points in that and I still go an A, like what the hell? Yeah, that's just how overpowered the time bonus is. Yeah, I don't <laughs> deserve that. I it should have been a C at best. Time. Shadow. Doctor? What's that what is they can't deal with here? To me, like a good boy. <laughs> You yes. Were once a great invention from my grandfather's past, <laughs> but this is my time. Give me the Chaos Emeralds, and I will spare your life. Doctor. What? This is something I must do on my own. I must uncover the You truth. know, I just love what Maybe we've done with Shadow's morality. Like, I don't listen to anyone. Oh, wait. You I better listen to Black Doom. Yeah. Actually, no, Eggman is my friend. Fuck you, Black Doom. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, so, yeah, I want to kick Sonic in the face, so I'm just going to take that animal from him. Now, I'll work with Black Doom. Actually, no, fuck you, Eggman. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I, I, it's hilarious, because I, I love how the um, the dark ending in the pure hero route is literally just... I, I just want, I just want to go up again, like... I just want to <laughs> go up against, like, whatever goes up against you, Sonic, because, like, <laughs> I'm a jerk-ass, I guess. <laughs> like, yeah. it's so stupid. Yeah, like... Alright, Sonic, let's destroy this alien threat. At the last minute, fuck you, Sonic, I was actually with them the whole time. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yeah. This game is so stupid. Yeah, the game, like, doesn't care about what choices you take, it's like, it's more concerned about what stage you go to instead. Yeah. I was saying this in my neutral run, but I feel like what they should have done instead, or like, one idea I had anyway, is that instead of having, uh, like, the level list they do in this game, just have it so... It's one big story, it's one long story path. Each level has a dark and hero route. They have like two routes for each, like two main routes for each stage in a similar way that some stages in this game have. Um, yeah. And the more, if you do mostly hero missions, then the final stage you do will be like against like Black Doom and all that. But if you do like mostly dark missions, then you'll fight against Sonic and the commander, I guess, I don't know. Uh, like that probably could have worked. Yeah. But I guess I'm good at planning. Yeah, I I don't mind the idea of the morality morality system, but the way they do it, especially with the final story being a thing, it just makes it so like, why should I care? No, right? Like, why should I care about the choices I make yeah. when there is a definitive ending? Yeah. Like if, if they just made it so there were Be gone. there was just two allow you to there were just the two and two main endings, and you just end the game like that. S similar to how Spider-Man: Web of Shadows perfect. does it, um, I feel yeah. like it would have been much better. Also, can we just comment on how we just fucked over Vector, and now he's helping us beat up Eggman? Yeah, it's like I didn't actually find the computer room, but I, <laughs> you're in this fight because. Screw Black Doom, I guess. Yeah. What is he? Th what? <laughs> like, Finally, what is Black Doom doing right now? Emeralds. Oh, you mean Yeah. <laughs> Have you it's like, oh, cool, you got the Chaos Emerald. I'm gonna bugger off now. Who created you. <laughs> I am Shadow yeah. the Hedgehog. The also, life what even is Eggman's logic here? The arc. I, I have no on. idea. What, like, what is, why is he even here in the first place? I am living proof of the ultimate life form. Because Gerald this is who I am. I, I guess. What? <laughs> Leave now and never oh, so return. Also, I'm more fake man I here. Allow anyone to what the, the actual fuck arc. did Shadow just say? <laughs> yeah. 
I also love how that's like, I think the only ending with Eggman that Shadow doesn't kill him. Actually, I think that's the only end uh, the neutral route. Mm. Like, I think if you do the semi-evil route, but then do a hero mission, Shadow won't kill Eggman. Mm. Just tell him to fuck off. It's kind of interesting that Eggman's the only only one that dies. Like, he doesn't he doesn't kill yeah. Sonic. Black Doom's fine. It's like, all right. Till the end. <laughs> yeah. I know. Like, just. It's kind of weird, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Hi. <laughs> well, it's... that's free endings down. Indeed. Still, I've still got a long ways to go. Um, but if they, <laughs> if they brought, if they did like a Shadow Two, how would you want them to go about that? People don't. <laughs> nice. <laughs> well, this is an objectively terrible game. Yeah. Oh, but also, they kind of wrapped up Shadow's backstory. They That's actually true. wrapped up his story entirely. And yeah. now we don't know what to do with him. Yeah, this was, yeah, uh, we were talking about earlier about running, bringing Shadow back to uh, do more for his backstory is fine, but the problem with that is that past this point, there's like nothing for him to do, so he's just kind of awkwardly in the background folding his arms for like most of the games now. Yeah. Like, <laughs> let's see ya. <laughs> he was in 06 as a gun officer for mm. some reason. <laughs> and then in Generations, he had a Chaos Emerald he beat him up for. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh... Yeah, he was also in Forces. Yeah, it is own like small Kicking, DLC uh, part. Yeah, you know, he kicks infinite in the face. Yeah, I am not weak. I can't wait to <laughs> just <laughs> oh, never good. show your face again. I can't wait Man. to rip on that game. All right, I will now wear this mask to prove how powerful I am. Shadow, bro, that's literally what I told you to do. You are my bitch. <laughs> now. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! That's basically what it boils down to. It's so stupid. Yeah, I, I pro probably won't be like five years or something until I get to forces, but I'm gonna have a hell of a time with that one. Hey. Completely change the avatar each level. Oh god, that would be a mess. I. Yeah. Well, playing dress up with the avatar is the best part of the game. That's true. Uh, <laughs> like, I would just pay for a game full of nothing but avatar stuff. Sure, true. I, I would actually... <laughs> oh, hey, the Yamacha gun. That's a really fun weapon, actually. But uh, I do... Um... What am I trying to say? Uh... I, yeah, I do really like the customization in Forces, um, and I will say that like, I wouldn't mind seeing them do a spin-off where it's just nothing but the OC. I yeah. feel like that could have been that could make for a fun game. I mean, how else am I gonna put Cold Steel on the Sonic the Hedgehog? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> right, do you have anything else you want to say before we end? Uh Boneless pizza. <laughs> oh man. Nice. Also, follow me on itch.io, I guess. Okay. I'll try and remember to put like uh links in the description. Uh, okay. That's Yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Alright, so if we're done, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys for whatever the next story play for ends up being. So, goodbye for now, I guess. Shadow kills all the black. <laughs> <gasps> Aliens. <laughs> yeah. Oh!
pretty much. I mean, the invaders, not African Americans. Oh, God. Oh.